Hey everyone, my name is Tanner Bell for LittleCraftYourDay.com. In today's video, we're doing a craft project for back to school for Craft Attitude, a printable film that is for arts and crafts and a lot of other uses. You can use this on shoes, you can use this on wood, you can use it for home decor, scrapbooking, card making, pretty much anything you can think of. And this is an awesome film, so we're going to show you a easy project you can do with it. First, I want to talk about Craft Attitude for a second. Um, Craft Attitude has, it's a film, like I said before, and you get eight sheets of the film, so you can do eight, eight and a half by eleven, eight, yeah, eight and a half by eleven projects, because that's how large the film is. So when you get it out, you'll get a, the eight sheets, which I've already opened this, because this is the one pack that we're crafting with today, which is just regular Craft Attitude and you'll get the film. The film is glossy on one side and sort of smoothish on the other side. When you're want, when you're putting it into the printer to print, you'll want to put it the uh, glossy side down so it comes up and prints the right way. That's just a little tip I learned. Um, but what you'll want to do is there's a few t steps to using this. What you'll want to do is in um, Photoshop, uh, Office Word, when you're putting your pictures or whatever you decide to print out, because you can do anything that you can print, you can use. It's really easy, and you'll learn that in the video. Um, but what you want to do is flip it. I use Photoshop, and I just uh, went up to Image, Rotation, and just did the vertical flip. It was so quick. So no biggie there when doing stuff like that. It sort of could be difficult when you first figure it out, um, like the steps to figuring it out. But after you realize how easy it is, I mean, you'll be doing it within seconds. So that's the only problem I faced was learning how to do that. So what I'm going to show you is a back to school project. And I was actually at um, the dollar store yesterday. So I came home and I knew I was to go do this project with Craft Attitude. So I thought, when I went to actual school, I always would lose my schedule, especially at the first of the year, you get that new schedule and you just don't know what to do because you can't memorize it yet. You know, you're learning, but for the first week or two, you just are so confused. So I'm going to be using Craft Attitude and putting the schedule on the clipboard. So it's really easy. All you wanna do is just print it out and do the flip, like I said before. And I just found a schedule off the internet because I couldn't find one of my old ones. But what we're gonna do now is we're just gonna cut it out before you remove the film from the backing sheet, which is just like paper. Okay, so I have this here, and what we're going to do is we're gonna put it down onto this um, clipboard right here. So this is the clipboard, and we're gonna put it on like this, but we're going to use a glue stick, and I have a Xyron glue stick here. Okay, so I'm just applying the glue stick onto our clipboard. Um, you don't might not know exactly where it is, so I would go a little bit larger than what you think so. So as you can tell, I'm just applying the glue stick on here, and we're doing this really quick because go. So we're just gonna peel this film up, and as you can tell, it's just a really nice film. And this is the backing sheet I was talking about. We can just toss that to the side. So then we're gonna take this right here and put it onto our um, clipboard. So I'm just gonna smooth this out. You do not wanna put too much pressure onto the film because it will stretch it. So you do not want to do that. And I'm just going to apply this out right here. Um, if you can tell that you forgot to add some, you can peel it up. Because one cool thing about this is it is removable. So I'm just going to add just a tad bit more down here. And you know, you don't have to do everything perfect the first time. This is one of the sort of forgiving types of material. Um, a lot of you teens out there might not have spray adhesive. So when working with a glue stick, it is really simple. So we're just gonna apply this here and stretch this out. And as you can tell, I'm just using the tips of my finger, just going over it real gently, smoothing it out, and just going around all the creases and everything. So you can just smooth this out. And now you have a really cool way to never lose your schedule. So this is it right here. And what we're gonna do is on the back, I wanna decorate the back too, because what's a clipboard if it's not really decorated? So we're gonna trim this one out. And I just designed this in pickmonkey.com, really simple. And we're going to apply this too. Okay, so we have this right here. And what we're gonna do again is we're going to just apply our glue stick on here. And then we're gonna go peel it off and put it on. Okay, so what we're gonna do after we put our adhesive down, we're going to peel this off right here. And it's a pretty large sheet, so you can just try to flex it out and make it go on nicely. 
you want to start at the top. As you can tell, it sort of got stuck here at the bottom. So what we're going to do is we're going to start from the bottom and move our way up. So place this right about here. You can get it as straight as possible. Um, it doesn't have to be perfectly straight. Okay, so I got this on here and I'm just going through and evening out all the bubbles in here. Definitely when you're working with a larger sheet like this, um, just be take your time and work with it as it goes. So as you can tell, I'm just smoothing this out here. And this is another awesome, easy project that you can use with Craft Attitude. And this is removable. And as you can tell, over here in these two corners didn't get enough glue. So I'm just going to fix that right here. And this is just a really simple idea when you're wanting to add that extra touch to your next project. And another thing is when you're going back to school, you're always trying to impress people. You're always trying to stand out and be yourself. So this is another project that can definitely stand out. I took these pictures from Instagram. So if you have a lot of friends and you all hang out a lot and stuff like that, this would be perfect to take some of these pictures and make a collage of them and do that. I saw on the Craft Attitude Facebook page all kinds of awesome ideas. So I'm definitely going to recommend you all to go check that out as well. So what I want to do now is after that is all smoothed out, we can now decorate it with some more stuff. So I might add some buttons, I might add some ribbon, and we'll be ready to go. I'll have a picture at the end of this video showing you um, the finished product. So I hope you enjoyed this really simple video using Craft Attitude. I really enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed it too. As you can tell, Craft Attitude can work with so many different things and it's so easy. This is definitely my new go-to film. For Thanks for watching guys and I hope you have a great day.